Hello everyone, hope everybody is doing well on uh, today's video. We're going to go over how you can schedule um, the mass email push when your database is as large as, uh, for example, we here, let's do all leads. I have over 2,434 leads, but if I want to send them um, a mass email, I can only do this with 100 records at a time. So obviously, I'm going to need the help of uh, doing either filters or scroll through the entire leads to get away with it. So the one thing that you can do is um, segment your data first. So you have to create filters for all the type of uh, categories that you want to segment your date, your leads on. And once you have this, you can actually um, <clears throat> send the email. So let's see, I'm going to do... I'm going to test it with Let's see how many we have here. Teachable. So I have 127. Okay. Now let's do invite request pending. So we just created another uh, YouTube video and I want to share with them. Here, here's a good example. So I'm going to use this. So <clears throat> if I select all these records, I mean, I can only do 100 at a time. So what I do is I'll send this, select the template, and this assumes that you already have the template that you want to send a uh, schedule. So for example, I'm going to use this Soho Creator YouTube has an open rate of 20%. So I'm going to use that one. And I'm going to send immediately. The first 100 that I select, I'm going to send them immediately. You can trigger a follow-up action, like um, depending on what the user does. So if the email is open, clicked, or bounced, you want um, the system to, to do something, either update a status, send another notification, or anything else that you want to do on the follow-up. So you click Send. So that's done. If you click this little mass email view summary, you'll get a detail on how many were sent. But then once you're done with that, you can just click the tab here, uh, the arrow tab, to get the next 101 to 183. So now you can select this and you're going to send the remaining 83 records on a mass email. Now, remember that you, uh, you, do, you do not want to spam the, uh, your domain name with um, being flagged as a domain that pushes emails like very, very frequently. So you want to space them order. So the next batch of emails that you do, you can schedule them for later. So ideally, try to you know, um, give yourself at least 30 minutes before the next push. So that way you are not uh, sending a blast of emails all at once and running the risk of being flagged as a spammer. So that's it for today's video, guys. I mean, don't forget to segment your leads under the categories that you uh, are more interested in, in, in tracking or follow up on. And then use the schedule option um, to send an email under a different time frame so that you allow yourself to send emails uh, on, on a batching system. All right. If you have any questions, um, let me know. Don't forget to smash the like button 
And if you have not subscribed to the channel yet, uh, please consider to do so. We are going to be updating um, regular videos about Zoho Creator and Zoho CRM. So you can you know, be aware when, when, when we upload them as, as, as soon as they arrive in the platform. Have a great day and um, look forward to hear back from you with any questions or requests you may have.